The Sites Project is a new off-stream reservoir proposed on the west side of the Sacramento Valley, approximately 10 miles west of the rural town of Maxwell, spanning portions of historic Glen and Calusa counties. With a storage capacity of up to 1.8 million acre-feet, Sites would provide a significant supply of water for the environment, as well as for homes, farms, and businesses. Sites is a new water management tool to offset the impacts of drought and prepare for climate change. Unique from most other dams, sites would only be filled from Sacramento River flows by major storm events, would not dam a major river or block fish migration, and would be operated to enhance environmental flows during the most critical times. To provide environmental and water supply benefits, sites reservoir facilities include an in-reservoir inlet-outlet structure, a tunnel connecting Sites Reservoir to the largest of three pumping plants that can also be used to generate electricity and at least two electrical switchyards connecting to overhead power lines to separately connect to the state's nearby electricity grid. A pipeline would connect to a regulating reservoir that connects two existing agricultural canals with a new pumping plant and intake on the Sacramento River. A new fish-friendly screen diversion would be established on the Sacramento River with an intake capacity of 2,000 cubic feet per second and a release capacity of approximately 1,500 cubic feet per second. During winter storm events, water would be diverted from the Sacramento River to sites through two existing canals with diversion points located at the Red Bluff Pumping Plant Diversion and conveyed through the Tehama Calusa Canal and at the Glen Calusa Irrigation District intake at Hamilton City and conveyed through the Glen Calusa Irrigation District's main canal. The pumping plants could be used to generate hydropower, which would be used to complement solar and wind power sources. Operation of the proposed project would be in cooperation with the operation of the existing Central Valley Project and State Water Project systems and facilities. The proposed operation of the project incorporates three primary components. First, operating criteria for the diversion of water, rate, duration, and season from the Sacramento River to the site's reservoir, which would only take place after all Delta environmental conditions, regulatory requirements, biological opinions, and existing water rights have been met. Secondly, operating criteria for the timing and release of water from site's reservoir to the Sacramento River will be based on environmental needs and water supply demands based on hydrologic conditions. And finally, operations of the proposed project will be in cooperation with operations of State Water Project and Central Valley Project reservoirs, including Shasta Lake, Lake Oroville, and Folsom Lake. As currently proposed, the operation of Sites Reservoir could provide up to 500,000 acre-feet of water per year on average to meet critical environmental, urban, and agricultural water needs. Environmental water will provide benefits to salmon, delta smelt, migrating birds, and other wildlife in three primary ways. First, through exchange agreements with Shasta, Folsom, and Oroville, sites can preserve cold water in existing storage facilities to improve water temperatures and stabilize river flows. In critical dry water years, such as those experienced in 2014 and 2015, Shasta Lake storage could be increased on average by up to 200,000 acre-feet. In fact, analyses of the site's operation show that if the project were operational today, average juvenile salmon production would improve by up to 10% in critically dry years. Secondly, sites could release up to 40,000 acre-feet of water on an average annual basis into the Calusa Basin drain or to the Sacramento River providing pulse flows and nutrient-rich water to benefit Delta smelt in the Yolo Bypass. Finally, sites could provide up to 50,000 acre-feet of water on an average annual basis to benefit the Pacific Flyway and enhance wildlife refuges. Sites works for California. The project provides significant public benefits for wildlife refuge improvements, flood control, recreation, and native fish populations.